Hi everybody, this is Boaz Fallen. I'm here with the Daily Astrology Forecast for February 17th, 2016. So, the Moon in Gemini today is uh, squaring the nodes and it's quincunxing Mars and it could be a little exhausting if you're talking about your mental capacity. It's a bit like being in a math test and, and feeling that you need to be concentrated all the time. After that, you really need some peace and quiet and that's about what we have in the sky today. There's this very intense mental energy in the sky up to let's say uh, 1630 Central European time that's around 1030 Eastern Standard Time and then it cools down with a trine to the Sun which brings more optimism and and just uh, more flowing energy and the moon then becomes void of course and it only enters cancer at around 2030 Central European time that's around 1430 Eastern Standard Time and cancer brings with it the, the need for the familiar and the comfortable and the easygoing and, the, and, the, and puts the emphasis on your um, emotional uh, state and not your mental state. And it also Queen Conks Venus. So my advice for you for the rest of the day is just be others, be themselves and you be yourselves. And really concentrate on whatever does you good, whatever makes you feel well. Even if it says that you're going to be spend a night quiet at home by yourselves. Nothing wrong with that tonight. And one more thing that is happening in the sky today is that Venus is moving into Aquarius and bringing all these Uranian energies into our relationships, into our uh, relationship with money and the way we provide ourselves with satisfaction in our lives. So Uranian energies in our relationships. What does that mean? It means we want to make things more authentic, we want things wiser and more progressed. We want those ideas, those progressed ideas to be amplified within our relationships. And in times like this, a lot of people disregard whatever relationship they have and, 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 and go and try something new or even go and have an affair. And the, the answer isn't always to disregard what you have. If you could cherish what you have and bring that innovation and progress and authenticity into your, your relationship, that's even better. And if not, this time will help you to leave it behind and move forward in your life. And it could change the way we draw in money and funds into our lives using more creative and, and innovative and outside the box solutions to bring money forward. So, thank you for listening. And I hope you have a positive day. I'll see you all tomorrow. Bye-bye.